Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. Um, so today I am doing another video with my awesome Idio Pan. Um, this is a tunable tongue drum um, that comes with magnets pre-installed on it. Um, and what we're going to do today is we're going to take it from C major pentatonic scale, which is the scale that it comes tuned as, um, and we are going to move it to a C minor pentatonic scale and see how that sounds a little bit different. <laughs> um, so this is going to be a lot of fun. So your regular C major pentatonic scale is going to sound like this. you want to play a C minor pentatonic scale, that's what this is going to sound like. fun ethereal sort of sound um, that's not as upbeat and bright as your C major pentatonic. So changing it from um, your major pentatonic to your minor pentatonic is actually super easy. We're only going to be working with the third tongue, the sixth tongue, and the eighth tongue, the tiny little one at the top. <laughs> so in order to determine which tongue we're working on, we basically go from largest, which is number one, all the way up to smallest, which is number eight. <laughs> so it should be pretty easy for you to find um, number three. Let's work on that one first. Now number three, you're going to need a digital tuner to do this. Um, I recommend Pano Tuner. Um, you can find it on the Android store. Um, I'll put a link to it down in the description. It's super easy to use. Um, and when you hit your third tongue, if your Idiopan has just arrived, it's going to sound um, like a D uh, with no symbols or anything in front of it. And we want it to sound like a D sharp. Um, so we're going to reach underneath and move those magnets farther down the tongue. So we're going to take the magnets from up here and move them down a little ways to about midway through the tongue. And that's going to change it to a D sharp. Now to get it totally perfect, you're going to want to keep playing it with your tuner um, and making sure that you're getting it in exactly the right spot. Um, you want to get it as close to that middle marker as possible so it will sound really pretty. <laughs> um, if it's just a little too flat, then you push your magnets farther towards the edge of the drum. And if it's just a little too sharp, too on the high side, then you're gonna push your magnets a little farther towards the center of the drum. And that's how you get a D sharp there. So then that's gonna sound like this. Tongue one, two, three. <laughs> okay, so now we're gonna move on to tongue number six. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six. It's right next to the top one on the left if you're facing the idiot pan. And that one, we are going to tune to an A sharp. Um, it's already tuned to an A. So again, we're gonna to wanna to slide the magnets back towards the edge of the drum. Um, but you're not gonna to want to slide them entirely down the middle of the tongue. Since this one is smaller, you don't have to slide them quite as far. <laughs> um, and just keep working with your tuner until you get it tuned to perfectly in the middle of A sharp. Okay, and then we're gonna move on to tongue number eight, the very top one. And we're gonna tune that one again to D sharp. Um, it's tuned to a D, so you're going to want to move it towards the edge of the drum to raise the pitch to a D sharp. 
um, but again, not very far uh, because this is such a tiny tongue <laughs> that will um, change the pitch quite drastically if you move it a lot. <laughs> so there you have it. That's how you change the tuning from C major pentatonic into a C minor pentatonic. <laughs> and here is how it sounds as a C minor pentatonic drum. Um, just some playing around. <laughs> Hello everybody and thank you so much for watching my channel. Um, if you want to click the subscribe button right up there, then you can subscribe to my channel and see all my new videos. And if you would like to check out my Patreon, the link is down there in the description. <laughs> thank you all so much. Have a wonderful day.